Hello everyone, welcome back to Creations by Favi. If you're new here, my name is Fanny. I love to do quick and easy DIYs on a budget using recycled and thrifted items, as well as Dollar Tree items. If that is something that interests you, I would love for you to consider to be part of this family by hitting the subscribe and bell button to get notified every time I upload. So if you want to know how I did these beautiful DIYs, just keep on watching. My first DIY will be this beautiful wall decor mirror. Just like so. The materials I will be using are some popsicle sticks, this little circle decor, and this mirror that I have used in some of my previous DIYs as well as these wooden beads that I got from Amazon. So the first thing I will be doing is I'm going to start off gluing some popsicle sticks and I'm going to glue them sideways. I am going to start with one first and then gluing one on top of the other one just like so. To two of them, I will be cutting a little bit off, then gluing them to the circle, and I'm going to make a cross. For the first round, I will not be cutting the round parts off. I will be gluing four of them. Now for the rest of the popsicle sticks, I will be cutting one side off. Then I'm going to glue them to this circle thing just like so. For round three, I will continue gluing the rest of the popsicle sticks until most of the circle is full. Now I'm going to glue the circle part right on top of them using hot glue, just like so. By the way, I am not making fun of Funny. I love it when she says just like so. Now for the beads, I'm going to add some black paint to this bottle and I'm going to add a little bit of water Then I'm going to add a little bit of black paint. It looks like it's black paint. Then I'm going to shake it and spray paint these beads or spray the beads until they're all covered up. Once I am done doing that, I'm going to spray paint the popsicle sticks. Then with a cloth or a piece of paper, I'm going to remove some of the paint to make it look like it's stained. I love, love, love the color this gave it. When she first showed me the pictures of what she had done, I was like, oh my God, what color did you use? She's like, I made it. <laughs> this color turned out beautiful. Then I'm going to put the beads and I'm going to remove this paper from the mirror then add some hot glue to the circle so i can glue it to the mirror then i'm going to flip the mirror over so i can arrange the beads by eye i mean she just did it this way In order to hang this decor, I will be adding this piece of, uh, what is this? Um, I will be adding this piece of hanging picture frame thing. So this is going to help you hang this beautiful wall decor piece to your wall. And look how beautiful this turned out.
My next DIY is a modern wooden lantern. The materials I will be using are some more popsicle sticks, two different size, this L-shaped ruler I got from Dollar Tree, and this black paint, and some leftover wooden beads. I'm going to start off by putting one popsicle stick on the L shape and I'm going to measure it so like that I can cut the curvy size and I'm going to do this to four popsicle sticks. Once I am done doing that I'm going to send them a little. Using the same mixture I did with the black paint and water I'm going to spray paint them. I love the color this gave it, this off washed gray. I am going to set this aside and paint the smaller popsicle sticks. I'm going to paint them using the Waverly chalk paint and mineral. Once everything's nice and dry, I'm going to start making the lantern and I'm going to start with the first side. I'm going to use two of the popsicle sticks and I'm going to use the L-shaped ruler to make sure they are nice and straight. Then I'm going to start gluing the smaller popsicle sticks. I will be gluing eight, just like so. Once I am done doing that, I'm going to repeat the same process to the other two popsicle sticks. Now I'm going to use this can to help me stand these sides, or actually two cans. I'm going to stand both of the sides and then this is going to help me, or wait, wait, go back, go back. <laughs> I'm going to put two of the, okay, I'm going to put both of the sides side by side using these cans to help them stand up. Then I'm going to add eight more popsicle sticks using the hot glue. I'm going to repeat the same process on the other side, just like so. For the bottom pieces, I will be using four of the jumbo popsicle sticks. I'm going to measure them to the size of the bottom and then cut them. Once they are nice and cut, I'm going to send them using the same sand sheet. Then I'm going to paint them using the Waverly chalk paint in mineral. I will be gluing four of the popsicle sticks to the bottom, leaving a little space in between them. To make this more nice and sturdy, I'm going to add the other two popsicle sticks in the inside. And look how beautiful this lantern is turning now. Now I'm going to add the beads to the bottom. To add more details to the lantern, I will be using these Dollar Tree thumbtacks. In order for them not to break the paint sticks, I decided to cut this part off of these thumbtacks. So like that, I can glue them instead. And that is it for this beautiful lantern. I absolutely love how this turned out. You can use it all year round and decorate it however you like. And that is it guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and please subscribe if you haven't already. If you're wondering who is doing this voiceover, it is me, Maria from Crafting with Maria. So me and Fanny decided to swap videos and do each other voiceover. So go ahead and go check my channel out. So.
Thank you, Fanny, and see you next time. Bye.